all right people welcome back to another episode on the youtube channel we are gonna be trying something new trying something different uh we're gonna be playing the walking dead and i know i'm late you know what i mean this game came out how many years ago what was it like 2014 something like that 2013 this game came out years ago i know i'm late i've never played the game i've never watched a tv series i don't know if that has any correlation um and i've never watched a walkthrough or anything about it so i really don't know anything about the walking dead of course i've seen like little snippets here you know clementine and and you know just stuff that you see around the internet because it's the internet but i've never really digged deep into the walking dead game i've heard that is a great game you know what i mean and i usually don't give story mode games a try but i mean if i'm going to consider a story mode game i assume the walking dead is the first place to start so we're going to be playing a walking dead um little single player walkthrough whatever if you guys do enjoy things like this uh, i've been considering streaming the walking dead and then you know posting the snippets on uh, youtube or whatever but uh if you guys want to see more gameplay like this you know just let me know down in the comments hey smo i really enjoy your walking dead series can you do more and i'll do more you know what i mean um but yeah i think that's really about it i, I guess we could go ahead and start press play i don't know standard uh display style more helpful from ui and feedback when you make important choices turn off ui hits help in choice notification ah uh, it's like i don't know i don't know which one to choose actually because this tells me where everything is that i can click and then this doesn't you know uh i think i'm gonna go with standard just because it's my first walkthrough you know what i mean i'm going with standard episode one a new a new day episode one telltale game presents it's getting like intense bro you, you can like hear it in association with skybound entertainment the walking dead dun 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 all right episode one a new day it's like the highway or something i like the music oh they got my boy they got my boy caught slipping. What you do, bro? What you done did, my friend? Yeah, you, you gotta keep an eye on him, huh? You gotta, you gotta, you know, he might do something in the back seat you don't like, right? Uh, squinting and everything, huh? Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Okay, never mind. Oh, uh, why do you say that? Uh, I gotta press the. I thought I used the the arrows. I mean the the mouse. I gotta do the number. Okay, you know what they say about it, right? Okay, Why I, did I, didn't, say that? I didn't have enough time. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually, it's about now I get the I didn't do it. And what do you say? Not for me every time. Uh, not, not for, for me. Because guys in your position already said it enough. Oh, what's the cursor? Okay, now I use the mouse. Okay. Use the mouse to look around. And I aim to target at the rear view mirror. All right. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. You're from Macon then? Uh, so if you got an opinion, what do you think? You're from Macon then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Wee -oh, wee -oh, wee -oh. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. What am I supposed to look at? Oh, I gotta look at this. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. Hmm. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. So he's a professor. You meet your wife in Athens? What happened to your wife? You want to know how I see it? Not really. Not really. Well, too bad. It's my car. Huh. You might have the right to remain silent, but it don't mean I gotta be. He just opens his mouth and doesn't say anything. Regardless, 
Could be you just married the wrong woman. What happened to his wife? Fuck you, bro. <sighs> they ain't gonna say I married the wrong girl. There ain't no mistakes. I did the right choice. Even I don't know what happened to his wife. Stop worrying about things you can't control. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. Did I just see a hat on the he road? He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Yeah. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. Look at the road, That's bro. government property. And I'll be forced to look at the road, otherwise. bruh. So he stops and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, mama it's all a big mistake. <laughs> it wasn't me. Maybe he was innocent, so he did do it. Maybe he was innocent. Innocent? They caught the fucker red handed, oh. stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. Oh, he sits damn. in my car screaming bloody There's murder a hat. that it wasn't him. There's a hat he on the right side of the road, bro. Himself. That's the second time I've seen it. It goes to show people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Uh, I got another good one for you. What's that? This one's a little bit less depressing. You better hit somebody, bro. Hilarious if I do you say so. Watch this out, bro. Time. I think I survived that. That was a lot of bumping and hitting. That was a lot. I'm turning his audio down. It's, it's a little loud. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to be that loud. That's a little loud. Knocked out. Wake up, bro. There's something going on outside, man. Have you staying asleep this entire time? Oh, shit. That man's leg look messed up. Thirsty. Ah, fuck. Yeah, yo, yeah, yo, yo leg is. Destroyed, bro. He doesn't look so good. Use the mouse to find a way out of the car. Look at the shotgun. I gotta get out of the car first. Come on. Get out of this guy. One more time. Nice. I need to drag myself out that window. Okay, so I used the W key to move forward. I need to drag myself out that window look at the door and use the mouse will look at the door oh wait what look at the door use the mouse will never cause one or two select the option i'm looking at the door right maybe this door no 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 it's gotta be this door look at handcuffs look at window or climb out window oh okay i might be a forehead it's okay that's gotta hurt though Imagine being handcuffed with a with a, a leg you can barely use, trying to get out of the door. That's gotta hurt. Damn. Gotta get out of here, bro. That man looked like he crawled out the car and died. I don't know. I like that. I like the way that the shotgun look. I like the way that shotgun look. Let me get these shells over here. You can get it. You can get it. It's okay. It's okay. Why would he have needed that? I don't know, but I think I need it too. Go ahead and get that guy. 
I'm gonna pick this guy up. Why would he have needed that? I can't. I can't pick that guy up yet. Maybe I gotta look at the cop first. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Officer. God damn. Yeah, you, that that guy don't look so great, does he? Pretty sure that guy is completely done, done for. Can I can I look at the shotgun now? Why would he have needed that? It's gotta be. What am I missing? Is there anything else here? It's just a shotgun and the dude, right? I don't know. Let me. I guess. Oh, I can. I can go over here. I don't think there's anything over here. Oh, maybe I need to find the keys for the handcuff to uncuff myself. Maybe he's got that on the cop. Officer. Oh, here we go. Yeah, let me get some keys. Please, please, and thank you. Shit. What happened? Oh. Yoink them guys, bro. Look at the man. Look, fingernails. Them hoes was yellow. Look at his fingernails. Them guys look nasty. Yeah. Oh, he making noise. Officer. Oh, now you shit. need that shotgun. You should have got it in the first place. Now you need the shotgun. Where that guy at? Where that guy at? Pick that guy up. Pick the shotgun Get away from up. Me. Reload that guy, bro. Put it. Oh, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Put that guy in there, bro. Now blast him. I'm gonna do it. Boom! Off with your head, boy. Do it again. Do about three times. You gotta make sure. Hey, throw that guy away. I need that guy. What you doing, bro? There's one of them. There's 50,000 more. Is that another one? Bro, you gotta pick that shotgun back up. She don't look like a zombie, though. Call out to mysterious figure. Look at cop. His skin's all rotten and he smells like shit. <laughs> what the hell is this? Help! Help Go me! Get someone! There, there's been a shooting! What's that? What's that noise? What's that? Get the shotgun, bro. Shotgun, bro. I don't like that noise. Get the shotgun, bro. Or get to the... Where'd the shotgun go? Oh, no, bro. Get to the limping. There's too many of them. Get to the limping. That man don't have an arm. Missing a whole hand. Nice. We made it. We made it. They can't. They can't climb over that, right? Okay. They really trying to push it down. I'm not over there having fun. You need to get something for that leg. That leg doesn't look so good. That leg does not look good. Look at treehouse. Look at the sliding door. I mean, I'm about to go inside this house. Home. I'm about to get something for my leg, like a bandage or something. I wonder if anybody's home. I keep forgetting that I have to like actually move him. I 
All right. I wonder if anybody's home. Try opening the sliding door. Maybe I have to go through the front door instead. Can I go through the front door? Can I go this way? I don't think I can go that way. Wait a second. I I could use my mouse wheel this entire time. I've been looking at and then the hand. Oh my, I didn't know that. I didn't know that at all. No wonder it kept just looking at stuff. I don't think anybody's home, huh? Go ahead and open that guy up. Oh, it's locked. Or not. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Ah. Shit. Yeah, you gotta get something Hello? for that. I'm not an intruder. You I'm sure? This don't look so good. These people might need more help than I do. Everything was all over the place, bro. Oh no, it looks so good. Look at this coloring book. Oh! I just slipped on some blood. Now I'm all bloody, man. I need. I need. What's that? What was that? I had a, a beat. They got a note. Open the drawers. Probably some food in here. That was a radio. Okay. That could come in handy. Yeah. I had a silver radio. That can come in handy for sure. What are those paper towels? Paper towels. Some boxes. I think there are three new messages. All right, so I turned the subtitles on because I figured some people might want that. So, yeah, got to figure out why that beeping noise is going on. It's like a phone, a house phone or something somewhere full of blood. Oh, Jesus. Look at this, uh, this coloring book. That's a pretty little dwawi. Little unicorn. I got food, bro. Can I eat it? Can I, can I eat some fruit? Or is that fake fruit? It's fake. Damn, bro. Fake fruit, bro. Was bad. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Three new messages. Message one left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Oh, please, no. please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby, if you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. I have a mouse for you. Huh? No, I don't. You have it. Celeste got it. Now go away. Hello? You need to be quiet. I need to be quiet, bruh. I'm not a monster. Who is this? Are you okay? Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. I don't know them guys coming home. I don't know them guys is coming home, bruh. What's your name? Where are your parents? How old are you? Uh, where are your, where parents? Are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. We're Sandra. Where the are? are you safe? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. 
That's smart. See? Can you see me? Hello. I can see you through the window. Hello. Oh! Is that Sandra? Bobby Wee! E! Not you slipping on the blood again. Not you slipping on the blood again. Get your ass out of my face, bro. You want some more? Get your ass out of my face, bro. Not you about to take a little, like a, take a bite of my leg. No, I failed. No. Get on, bro. Um, let me get that. Let me get that guy. Boom, bro. Again. Boom. Again. Boom. Again. Boom. Five more times. Keep on going. Why her? She ain't got no pupils. Got a whole white eye. No pupils. Hi there. Clementine, you assisted in a murder. Did you kill it? We are now murderers. I don't know. I think so. Something else did. I think something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Oh, two nights ago. no. Yeah, that's probably what happened. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. Yeah, I would too. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, oh. I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Look for help before it gets dark. Get out of here once the sun goes down. I'm about to look for we help. We need to find help before it gets dark. When it gets dark, it's over. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Definitely not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. She slammed that kind of hard. All right. I got to follow you. She's just running. Wait up, man. Not as fast as you. Where'd she go? Hey. Oh, look, there's people. Oh, man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Hot dish night. Come on, let's open this gate. Let's ask him for some help. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? They ain't coming home. It's over with. They won't. Let's go. They won't. We should go. Then they'll find me, right? Yeah. I won't leave you alone, okay? Hey, man. Holy shit. Don't eat us. We're not going to hurt you. Yeah, thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. The chomp. What are you doing? What is going on? We're looking we for need help. help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. The. This is Clementine. I'm Chet. Hey, Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. Just some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. That's all right. What do you want to do? I... 
The monster's coming. We gotta go. We gotta do it, bruh. Leave quick. Let's go. Push! Push! Look at Clementine helping. Putting in that work. For just some guy, it seems like you've saved a bunch of lives today. I did. I saved a bunch of lives today, bro. I saved like three. Nice little farm you got going on here. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. You too. What, what was the name again? Chet? Something like that. Chit? Something like that. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing hmm. new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Yes, sir, he did. Your boy's a lifesaver. We need a place to stay. We just need some help. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then. I hate my daughter. Oh, not his daughter. He's well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? What you trying to say, bruh? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah. It's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Why? Let's have a look. What was that about? Yeah, this is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? My name is Lee, bro. It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? I fell car accident jumping a fence. Car accident. Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? I was going to jail, bruh. Oh, out, of Atlanta. out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with? The girl. This man is awfully I nosy. Was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. Thank you. How did you catch your name, darling? Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. I that agree. Doesn't seem necessary. What you talking about, bro? I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son is right. Your yeah. son's right. You're going to want to fortify this place. As much Just as like possible. That doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. This man Lee, tripping. Come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. A man got ran over a dead cop crawling on a down dead people walking, bro. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. 
We got plenty of chores as it is. Oh, we must the, 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 the wall, we, we need a wall. It, really? I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? I we'll probably me, just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Hmm. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. All right, then. It smells like... Yeah, I bet. Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that. That was a swear. Yeah, it was. You right? I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. Pretty far. Okay. Don't tell me they're gonna get attacked in the middle of the night. Is that his wife? What happened to his wife? Something bad happened to his wife. Hey, get up. I'm itchy. I bet you are. Well, you slept, slept in a on barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? Daddy. Um, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. <laughs> we better get going or we won't hear the end of it. Seems so excited. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking, uh... Where do parents name their kids Duck? We're from Fort Lauderdale. We were on our way back before things up and went bananas. Come here, duck. The word <laughs> is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Why, well, thank you. Maybe, uh, let's see how things turn Maybe. out. Maybe. We'll see how things shake out with this Herschel guy. <laughs> Good luck with that. He's a hard ass. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah, I bet you well, do, Doc. I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. Duck look kind of, uh... I can keep an eye on your little dog. I don't know. He's just, he, uh, special. Yeah, Duck, Duck seemed like he kind of special. He's a very, uh, special dude. You know what I mean? I had to talk to this lady real quick. You actually, uh, you two actually look relaxed. What do you do? How was the city? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help and... We just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home tomorrow. But even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Yeah. Of course I do. Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Those are the things we live for, right? Yep. With those gone, what's the point? You two actually look relaxed. What do you do? I think I'm going to exit. Okay, Lee. I'm not going to bother you anymore. I want to see how this, this this wall is doing. There's a dude on a tractor. Chicken coo. Let's talk to this guy. See what he got going on. Shall Kenny? 
Hey there, uh, Kenny. You need help? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I'm trying to say, you, bro. I ain't no, got no kids. No, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. What's your plan? So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Okay. Okay. Alright. How's your son, son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. I feel that. See you. I feel that, I feel that. Can I go over to the tractor? Yes, I can. That RC is a tractor. Look at the fence. Look at wood. It's just whatever scraps I could find around the property. <laughs> Do you uh, think this thing will keep them out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. That's good. Sean's still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. I can do that, bro. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Jeez. You gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you can to survive. Like put a gun to that kid's head and pulled the trigger? Fuck that, man. I'd do it. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned. Ain't no put kid the no more. The gun right That's a zombie. The kid's eyes and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... I had to shoot one to bash a poor girl's brains in. Fast a poor girl's brains in. Whoa. Uh, I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? I don't even know. Ex wife. I'm not quite sure where my ex wife is. Ex wife. Ah. Oh. Yeah. For sure. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. Ex-wife, huh? And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Thank you. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. I can go help the dude real quick. I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind helping do real quick. I guess I just... Back the way that I came. I gotta talk to him anyways, yeah? See what he got on his mind. What's up, bro? What you got going on, bro? Why you look at me like that? How'd you get out of Atlanta? I was getting arrested. I got a ride. I was on my way out anyways. I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. 
Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. <laughs> Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was family up to? and yes. friends. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No, my parents are in Macon. My no wife anymore. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. Thank you. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I told you that already. I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? What is it? Mind your own business. What is what it? What is it? I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. Oh, and I'd start checking the attitude, friend. What? I don't have no attitude. I did not Go. have an attitude, I'll get bruh. My gun. Oh, my man. Come on, bro. Oh, he got the wheel stuck on him. Oh, no. Oh, no, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know, bro. I'm going to help him. Come on. Fuck. It's crushed. I got you. Eddie, help Lee. Push the thing. Push the tractor, bro. He just Eddie. gonna run? You a whole hoe. Push the tractor. Is it that heavy? No! <laughs> Oh, it's over with. It's over with. I'm okay, Pop. I'm okay. Nah, you dead. You. Don't worry. You can't fix him. We'll stitch you up. <laughs> that man gonna die. It almost, it almost got me, man. It, <laughs> Lee tried to save me. I know, son. I. Eh, uh, he's dead. Yep, he's dead. I tried to save him, though. I could have saved him if it wasn't for him. He could have put his kid down and came over and pushed the tractor with me. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here! I'm yeah. Sorry. Nah, you know. Sorry. Not. Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. You tried to help him, but this piece of shit let him die. <laughs> it's my fault. It's nobody's fault. It's Kenny's fault. Yeah, it is if Kenny's Kenny fault. Helped, yeah. His son would be alive. If he would have helped. And that's why I wish you were dead for the rest of my life. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. My man just ran off. You could have set dude down and, and came and helped push the tractor with me. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Now, if you would have helped, he would be alive, big mini head, mini head boy. He just ran out of gas. Well, 
This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Looks like a guy over there. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh no no, that's a zombie, bro. Fuck! That's a whole zombie, bro. We're trapped! Ah! No! No! It's over with for him. Knock him out, run. guys! Nice. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, fuck I you, bro. Mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. We ain't zombies, that's all that matters. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Chill Whoa, out, chill lady. The fuck out, lady. We're just people trying to avoid those things, just like you. Don't come in here and swear at me. Hey, I'll say whatever you. I want if you start threatening these people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I I have to pee. Aww. I go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's an asshole. That's She's an sure. asshole. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He was not he bitten. bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. He Over was not bitten. Body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? We fuck him up, cuz. Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle it. We kick his ass. We kick That's his ass, bro. Thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. Ooh. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. My man Please is clean. Stop this. It's My man is him. okay. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Sit down, Sit or down. else. Well, that's it. You're gonna whoop me? Hell yeah. You and what homo parade? This one. <laughs> that's good. Little boy, before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Oh no, you did. Turn fast. He's just a then boy, bro. There'll be three. It's a little boy. I think we can handle him. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. Hit him, Kitty. Knock this guy out happily. Oh, oh, Jesus. Bro. oh man. What? Come on, kitty, you can't take a hit. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> <Come and talk. laughs> no, don't fall out now. Don't fall out now, bro. Get away from her, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Kill! 
Kill! Kill! Thank you. She got aim though. She got the aim though. You okay? Just great, thanks. I like that. Uh, guys. Everybody down. Stay quiet. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Oh, somebody got the machine like guns the out there, bro. I don't know. Somebody got oh, the big God, guns. Whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and the Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Ah! What's wrong with him? Was he uh, the one bitten? I told him to calm I down. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? No, you it's shut his up. Heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Why are you asking me? I don't know how to do that. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It I'm a matter. professor. I'm smart. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If nice. you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Larry's an asshole. Eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. I like her. Now get him those pills. She fine. Where are we going now? Stationary. How was this? Examine a newspaper. Read the whatever that was. I don't want to read. I want to. I want to gather some materials. ATM. There ain't no money in it. Might be money in there. Hold up now. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Wait, energy bar? Let me get that guy. Yoink. My. Hold on, has he got some more bars? He got some. Hey, Columbia time. Are you hungry? It's not much, but here you go. Here you Thank go. Thank you. Of course. Here you go. I don't want to talk to them. Open the office door. Alive inside. I can't. I can't think about them in here. Get that. Oh, yeah. Search the first aid kit. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Got anything else in here? What's that? What's that pole? a cane what's that this is my dad's cane he'd zip around oh, here oh i'm so oh so this is their oh nah, he was okay 
I this is the f- this is the the drugstore that their family owns. Than any god dog ever could. Oh, he cool? that's why he like said he can't have. think of them in here. My dad gave it to me. See, dad's just smart like that. That makes sense. It's all coming together. We gotta clear this door for when we find the keys. Yeah, we do. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Oh, look at her. Sure. Look, it's so cute. Here we go. Might be a Lots monster in there, though. The drawers. Mm. Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't think. I bet my dad does. Your dad a doctor okay. or something? Here we go. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? Let's not talk about that. Do you play any sports? Let's just move the thing. What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor and uh, my dad is an engineer. Oh, they get they Those got are good okay. Jobs. Okay. What's your job? I uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Because they're dead. I hope not. It's just complicated. I wouldn't blame them. Because they're dead. Oh, I'm assuming they're dead. I don't know. I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got us some trouble, but keep that between us. I'm not a bad guy. I killed someone. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ow! What happened? Oh, poor little Are finger. You okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Maybe it's in this drawer. No, not in there. Uh, the first aid kid got to have a bandage. See, bro, five brain smoke, bro. Five brain smoke. Here you go. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Bandage. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Oh, made your goal. Lee? Yes, sir. Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll find us. I don't think they will. I don't think they will. They want you to be safe. We'll find them if we can. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Nice. Alright, let's look inside this pharmacy. It's locked. Damn. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Uh... Photo... Bedding... Let's be able to get this photo. There's a picture of his folks. So it looked like, yep, yeah, that's him. And his, his, uh, his folks. Why he do that for? Find anything? Oh, my family dog. The only place is a picture. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. 
I know who you are. You do? You're who Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Oh! This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. Oh my <laughs> god! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Oh my! That's so much information I gotta, no, I gotta put in, bro. The first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group. Then we'd have a problem. That is crazy. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Worry about it. That is crazy. So he killed a state senator that was sleeping with his wife, and that's why he got the life sentence and was headed to jail. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. All right, let's look they at this TV. the remote for that thing in here someplace. Wait, isn't there a remote in here, though? It's the remote to my dad's TV. Surprise, the key's not in there. That's what I figured. Oh, man. <laughs> I should have guessed that, too, I guess. All right, where are these keys at so I can get inside the pharmacy? Uh, I can exit. Oh, he said the key's got to be in here somewhere, right? So why would I exit? My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. It's locked. We need to track down the keys Damn. if we're gonna help Larry. I guess we have no other choice but the exit. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? Of course uh, not. Why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Oh. He slept with my wife. Was he bad? He slept with my wife. He was. We gotta find these keys, man. What's that? Another energy bar? Don't mind if I take that guy for myself. Thank you. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. Oh, his no, name I... Ducky now. Man, I ain't giving Duck no candy, bro. Keep that for myself. Uh, photographs. Hey there. <laughs> This is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Oh, we gotta help Glenn. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, alright? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do... Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Let's do it. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. I like her. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. She fine. I like her. All right, let's go. Let's dip. Where's the exit? Where's the front door? Isn't it a... 
uh, isn't it to the right? Another energy bar? We got a lot of energy bars. I'm keep keeping these. Keep on keeping. No, I'm not giving her no energy bar. So that's the imp where's the exit? Cause I'm lost. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Oh, here's the exit. Okay. Now, how do I get out? I want to go help Glint. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? Yes. <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Yeah. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring him back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Jesus. That's a lot of zombies. Damn, my man got his intestines just on the ground. They just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. But we gotta help Doug, bro. I can give him the remote. Take brick. What happens if I give him the remote? Think you can do anything with this? Yeah, I used to fiddle around with stuff like that when I was a kid, but there's not much to do with it now. Man, I miss my robots. Oh, uh, so a strange guy, Doug. He's good with robots. I know. I know. Let's take this brick. Reach that brick. What you mean it's right there? You were telling me you can't reach a brick. I think you can reach the brick. I don't think there's anything else I can. Oh. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? You could just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Hey! Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Look at the TVs. To take notice. But not enough. I oh, don't care about the TVs, huh? I thought they cared about the TVs. All right, my friends, I've been recording for like an hour and 30 minutes, so we're going to call it here and I will see you guys. Oh, I can actually open this now. Okay, yeah. We're going to be we're going to continue when I come back on the next episode of uh, The Walking Dead. Appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave that likey like like my friends and uh yeah. Uh let me know down in the comments if you guys actually enjoy watching this and everything and I'll make, you know, more games or videos like this i guess but yeah appreciate you guys watching have a great wonderful afternoon day morning night whatever time it is for you i hope it's lit and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out guys